in Delfina Plaza when you go through the you go through the secret uh you have to hover off the boat in the canal and you go below the bridge and you like hover in and then you you're the giant you're the marble Mario is the marble it's pretty crazy I think all together combined Mahjong and Pachinko games on Super Nintendo. I think there's like a hundred combined. Something like that. I usually just play the Pachinko games for like, you know, a few minutes and then move on. I mean, I don't know how to win this. How do you win this? I don't know. I don't think there is a way to win. Get all the numbers? I feel like that's impossible because for some reason they're not coming through on... Oh, well, you know, when they go in the middle, it's usually pretty good. Kind of. I'm getting a lot of balls now, though. Also, I love how you got your Beyblade in the bottom right corner. Very important. Don't forget to get... When you go to the special game parlors in Japan to bring your Beyblade, because that's how you use the machines. You can't forget it. I feel like 12 and 13 are, like, zoned off. And so it's 4 and 5, you see? Like, it looks like I have to, like, how would I manipulate the, oh, shit, what the, f oh, can you change the board? Can you, like, can you, like, manipulate, I don't know. It's kind of like pinball if, for, like, sadomasochists, I think. That's how it feels, at least, to me. It's beautiful. There is... There are five of these alone. Hisato, his, Hisatsu Pachinko Collection. One through five. There's five of these. This series. And that's just one Pachinko series. There's like a million standalone games. There's other series that are like... There's a ton of them. It's just crazy craziness. Alright, that's enough of this. It's beautiful, but that's enough. It's gorgeous. You just want to keep watching forever, but... <sighs> Let's give it a three. Actually, wait. What did I give the first one? I gave the first one a five. Well, I guess I need to give the second one a five, too. Yeah, I said hot anime girl at the beginning. Okay, yeah. There's, there was more hot anime girls in this, so... It deserves a five on that alone. Oh, and, you know, this is... The story of Dr. Eggman as a kid who loves hot anime girls and pachinko. Perfect. It's an origin story if I've ever seen one before. Alright, now I get to play Sorcerer's Game. Nice. Good. I'm ready to play. Is there like a translation patch for this? Or does it doesn't matter, probably. There's probably not even like cutscenes. Some of these platformers, though, it's like, hmm, I want some cutscenes. Or I want to know what's happening. I think I have the emote. Don't I have that emote? Yeah. Got it. I hate that damn frog. I really do hate that frog 